other previous co-recipients of the Physiology or Medicine Award. Sunil Yamanaka was born in the year of my main finding, and we have never worked together or on the same material, yet we share our great wish that our contributions may help to alleviate human suffering in a similar way. For my part, I have worked all my life with eggs and embryos of frogs. Compared to other small animals, frogs have figured prominently in the world of literature. They served as a chorus in a play by Aristophanes, The Frogs, which won first prize when performed in 405 BC. A. A. Milnes, Toad of Toad Hall, was a very benign lord of the manor in his river community. Hilaire Belloc wrote, be kind and tender to the frog and do not call him names. A shiny skin, a polywog, or gaper grin, a toad gone wrong. The frog is justly sensitive to epithets like these. No animal will more repay a treatment kind and fair. I myself have been a major beneficiary of the view that no other animal will more repay treatment that is kind and fair. Sunil Yamanaka's work has involved mice and human cells and advances the prospect of providing new cells or body parts for patients. This concept goes back in history for a long time. The earliest example known to me of replaced body parts is exemplified by a Mayan skull dating back to 1400 BC. In this skull, false teeth made of stone had been implanted. This was not just to improve appearance in the presumed afterlife. The reaction of the jawbone showed that the false teeth had been hammered in in real life. It makes me wonder whether at that time an extract of the coca tree of South America, now used by dentists as an anesthetic, had perhaps already been discovered. Although body part replacement is not a new concept, the practice of reversing the process of cell differentiation to an embryonic state to form new cells of different kinds has become a realistic prospect during the last half century. This raises the possibility of giving people new cells of their own genetic kind, and hence without immunosuppression, to replace cells worn out by age or disease, the hope of the new field of regenerative medicine. Starting in my case, with no therapeutic benefit in sight, we are truly grateful to our immediate families and close colleagues, Ron Lasky for me and Kazutoshi Takahasha for Sunya Yamanaka for their selfless cooperation and support. We thank our hosts immensely for this truly unique experience provided by a spectacular week and also for this magnificent banquet. Thank you. En hyllning till grodan. En hyllning till grodan, det tycker jag också. Det är precis att vi känner ju fysik och medicin och annan här i kulturens gränser. Precis. Ja. Mm. Och det kommer fler. Mm. Tråkar jag veta. Det är en stor ära att få presentera Nobelpristagaren i litteratur.